Hey guys, and how about we play The Walking Dead? So last time we completed episode 4, we're now in episode 5, no Previously time left. I'll Walking just let this Dead. do the talking. Even though it seemed to lag there. What if my parents come home and I'm not there? I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Baby, you gotta see this. Here, Clem. Want some... batteries? That's when it happened. But we'll be in Savannah. I didn't even think about my that. My parents were in Savannah. They always stay in the same place when they go there. The Marsh House? Yes, that's it. Mm. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? We gotta go! So basically, they all followed us. Yeah. That's nice. Why? Clementine? Clementine! <laughs> yep. Clementine's gone. Wherever she is, I have to find her. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? Yep. We'll look for Clementine together. Hell yeah. I don't know why you're looking over here, Lee. Whatever I can do to help, you can count on me. So you'd rather trust Clementine's life with this incompetent fuck than with me? I'll stay behind and work on the boat. And there we have it. That was basically what happened. Yeah. So with us, um, Ben came with us. Omid and Krista came with us. Um, we went back to where Vernon and his group were, the Cancer Survivor people. They were all gone. So, yeah. But we know that it wasn't Vernon on the radio. So I think Vernon, it's just coincidence that they're both here. gone. There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody oh. needs to get hurt. So we do start here. Okay. No time skip at all. Are, are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch. No, Lee. Where have you taken her? This isn't Vernon. And you should really watch your tone. Mm. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. What do you want from me? Whatever it is, I'll do it. You can let her go. So you cut off before that last time, I, I think. I want you to never hurt anybody again. This isn't a kidnapping, Lee. What? It totally is a kidnapping! I don't care what it is! Just let her go! Great. To be fair, he is the guy in power right now, not us. So then, just hold on, Clementine. I'm coming for you. So how does he know us then? I mean, this is bad, but he we can deal with Thinks that we've together. hurt people, I guess. We're going to need to hurry. Maybe he's related to the person our wife slept with. I don't know. Otherwise, he's just been stalking us along the trip. This, you know, like zombie trip thing. How's that feeling? Bad. Not great. My hand is hot, and it's thumping a little bit. Well, you're still alive. That's something. It's very yeah, something. Totally. Faring a lot better than Duck was. We don't it seems. have a lot of time. Then again, I don't know how long that drive was. We're about to have a lot less. I don't know how long this walk was. In. Lee, find a way out of here. Okay, good. I'll well, check the back then. Pretty sure none of these things would be a way out. There is an elevator. Look at the elevator. Hey, I think I found a way out. Now open the elevator. <laughs> well, I was like, there's no button, but I guess electricity and all that. Can't get my hands in between the doors. Uh, okay, shooting it, I don't think it would be any good. Uh, find something to pry. Something to pry the doors. If we had a crowbar, that'd be great. Can we get a crowbar? That's like the, one of the iconic zombie weapons, you know? Or anti-zombie weapon, I guess. It'd be weird if you saw a zombie wielding a crowbar coming at you. Not that they'd be really good with it. As you'd expect in a morgue, right? Okay. Oh, what's that? Looks special. Rip spreader, that would do it. Looks like a contract. I don't want to 
imagine this being used on a body. Me neither. So let's just imagine it being used on an elevator. Just really quick to make sure. Nope, we're clear there. Dang it, not even animal crackers. Fine. But now we can get the elevator open and just get out of here before the zombies break in. Thankfully, at least, there can't be that many, right? Because the zombies that came from the train station are all up, you know, above ground. Yeah, crank ribs right. Okay. I'll have um, these doors open in two seconds. these ones were only in the sewer. So, I don't know. I mean, they're obviously a threat, but it doesn't seem like as big a threat as the zombies on the outside. There we go. Good job, Lee. Oh, no. No. That's not good. I wonder if that was because he worked, like he overexerted himself in this condition, or it was just a matter of time. Oh, jeez. Episode 5, No Time Left. They really mean that when they say that, jeez. Well, okay. What the hell happened? It's a bite. Well, what can we do? I don't know. Help me move him. Good. Moving's good. Jesus. Are you sure this will help? You got any better ideas? Okay. It's now or never. Oh! Oh! I'm awake! <laughs> Stop! He's awake! He's awake! Yeah! He's bitten. We still gotta do something. Huh. Do we have to cut it off, though? We're trying to save him. At the very least, buy him some time. That but this way makes the most sense. Of course not. Is there gonna be a lot of blood? There's gonna be a shitload of blood. <laughs> oh, thanks. What if he dies? Then the rest of us go after Clementine and get the hell out of Savannah. If there's any chance this saves his life, we have to take it. Ben, just look away. Let's do it. Maybe it'll work. It's a big risk. Can we cauterize it at least afterward? We're down here without a lot of options. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck it. Cut it off. This is going to hurt. Wow, yes. thanks, game. Yeah. Just knock me out first, please. Someone hit me really hard. <laughs> please. <laughs> no, you're just gonna... You're just gonna take it? This part you think is best. Uh, I'll go as fast uh, as I can. Uh, if I don't live through this, I need you to know you. Ah, okay. Ah! Try to stay still. Ah! 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 Gotta tighten the tourniquet. I'm sorry. Ew, yeah, she's not done. I thought she was done. Ah. <laughs> I don't like that part that much. <laughs> okay. We did it! We're still alive. That's good. Where's oh there's my arm. Hey. Oh my god, you're alive. It was getting to the point where we figured you weren't coming back. My arm's on fire. I can still feel my fingers. Holy hell. Oh, this hurts more than you can believe. Do you think you'll be able to travel? Lee is strong. Almost Holy enough. crap. Well, basically, Lee has no choice. It's either travel or get stuck with the zombies. The elevator's open. Let's go. I'll bring up. Ben seems beer. to be doing pretty well with all that. <laughs> Not quite sure about that face, though. Jeez. Long way up. We're gonna have to go as quiet as possible and see if we can make it to an empty floor. Or even the roof. All right. You think it's possible for you? Yeah. Keep going. Oh, just imagine if he like loses consciousness again from the bite. I mean, hopefully that'll just wear off. Like, there's got to be some of the I don't know. Is it zombie venom? Down there. Some of the 
whatever is still coursing through his veins, but uh, no big deal. it could just kind of filter out just after a while the if way. the source, you know, the bite itself is gone. That's my hope. Ah! What? You're okay, Lee. All right, I didn't see what happened. I'm just gonna keep holding W. Kind of concerned that I have this control, like I can move the mouse around. Like, um, zombie's not gonna start climbing after me, right? Don't have to kick him or something. Ooh, is that open? Okay, it's not. Good. What? What is it? Oh, that one's open. Watch out! Oh, jeez. Oh, Everything okay up there? I think I should watch out I after it passed myself. everyone else. So yes, then. We are taking up the rear, right? So yeah, that's what that means. Don't see me, zombie lady. Don't see me. I'm not even here. Ooh. There are a lot of zombies in that one room. Good thing is, I think that they'll stay in that room. I don't think they could get, like, to the roof or anything else from there, so... That's good. No, Helt! Oh, no! Like a bleak message. It's like made even worse by the fact that it wasn't finished. It kind of finished. They smeared it. Wasn't this city empty not too long ago? Yeah. Those Crawford bastards did one thing right, I guess. There's thousands. Did they follow us here? It'd be nice if we could just set the train Seems going the like other it, direction. That can't be, can it? That's crazy. They can't track. They just roam. Clementine's out there somewhere. Gobbled up in all of that. We'll get to her, Lee. We'll do whatever we have to. Good. Look, let's get our bearings and see if we can this figure out a way to make it across sure. town. Good? Good. 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 I uh, don't think we can ignore what just happened to Lee. He lost a lot of blood down there. Omid's right. I'm still you see yourself blood. getting gross. woozy or, you know, if it didn't work, just take it easy. Wasn't my favorite hand anyway. Really? Without old Lefty, I'd be done for. <laughs> Shut up, Omid. Seriously, though. Don't treat me any different. I got one goal, you hear me? Yeah, we do. Now what? We're good. I'm just we glad that we're so dedicated find to it all. a scared little girl. Let's try to get our bearings. Okay. Well, there's the sun. That's good to know. It's daytime. Uh, achievement unlocked into the fire. Good for us. Well, I don't think footprints would really help with. He or she walked bearings. away from whatever accident happened. Well, that doesn't really mean much. Oh, okay. Is there a way I can actually look out? I can't gain my bearings just standing up here. Oh, maybe I should talk to people. That'd be good. See anything? There's a fire escape here, and that's about it. That leads like right into them, though. Came with me. You didn't think I would? Just with all we've been through, it seemed like the only reasonable thing to I do. I appreciate that. I don't want that to be taken the wrong way. You still want to die? I'm more afraid of getting someone else killed. Uh, that's not a threat. I'll make sure that doesn't happen as well as I can. Thanks. Including me? <laughs> Getting bitten's not that bad. Really? No. It's a death sentence. <laughs> it's horrible. But try not to worry about it. Yeah, because that's reassuring for sure. If we get over to that bell tower, we might have some impact on all those walkers out there. Yeah, just have them swarm that side but of the building. then we just run through the Swarm that side of the building and then we could go down the know. fire escape. Yeah. What do you think? I think I'm staring down at my worst nightmare. Just a dusty haze of death. Try to keep your shit together. Need to get off this roof. We'll get it. But I think that's all from Ben. Um. Check the others, I guess. Okay, I could pick up the ladder, so we're gonna need that. No sense looking at the door. Hey, Krista! Let's that's talk. That's the church across the street from the mansion. 
Oh, Every street okay. should be just beyond that. Good. We need to head back that way. We'll stop off at the mansion, like you said, and make sure we didn't overlook anything. Yeah. Okay. I might have a way to clear us a path. I can make it to that bell tower. I can draw the walkers down at that side. I got of the it. I just want to talk to everyone first. That'll thin out the streets between here, the mansion, and River Street. Even if it's just for a few minutes. Wait, did, did we have more to say? Sorry, really quick. Was there more, Krista? Anything over here? Honestly, my vision isn't great. I think it's allergies or all that shit those walkers are kicking up. Fair. Aziz, that's funny. Any thoughts about the herd? Um... Got any good ideas for getting through that, uh, herd? I'm working on it. Are you gonna be able to hang in there? I'm fine. We're okay. The mansion's that way. Yeah. If we can use that bell tower to bring them to that side of the hospital, it won't be an easy trip back toward River Street, but it wouldn't be impossible. I'm with you. Just have to get over there. Yep. Allergies. Shit. People used to get those. <laughs> I know, right? You never see anybody in an end-of-the-world story with pay fever. <laughs> it's not the time to get wistful. I know. It's this deal with Clem. It's everything. It's put this rage inside me like I can't even say. I used to get allergies, too, and just... <laughs> fuck. Who was that guy? Someone with priorities? I was thinking you and Omid wouldn't come with me. We can't stop looking out for each other. You two have been solid since day one. What's this? Day three? Four? Even if you were a little well, annoying at the beginning. I appreciate it. <laughs> Alright, yeah, it really hasn't been long since we found them, huh? Like, they got on our train. I don't know how long we were on the train, but... Mm, we haven't really been here that long. Okay. What's up over here? Bell Tower. That's what's up. That's exactly <laughs> yeah. what's up. That could help. Anything hey. else to say? I think you're Clem's favorite. I think you're Clem's favorite. You know that? Really? Yeah, she's a big fan. Oh, that's not a lie. You get away with shit I never would. <laughs> We're getting her back, Lee. You know that, right? Yeah. When we get this fucker, we'll get out of sight and leave you with him. You get me? I get you. I like how serious he got there. How's the leg? It's doing a lot better. Thanks for going into Crawford for me. Even if it wasn't entirely for me. Clementine, yeah, too. No problem. She's tough as hell. Isn't she? Yeah. Don't worry more than you should about her, okay? I'll see if we can make it out to that bell tower. Okay. Okay. Be careful, though. So this. I don't want you going any sooner than you have to. Thank you, Omid. Thanks. So this is... No. No, I don't think that that would be smart. Let's not jump. Let's set up the ladder. Right? We'll set up the ladder if it's long enough. If it's not long enough, then yeah, we'll run and jump. But I'd rather not Lee risk a super jump, especially in this condition, with one hand to grab on with. Feel me? Yeah, I bet you do. Well, you know, like in the metaphorical sense kind of thing. You need a hand with that? <laughs> oh, was that not a joke? Never mind. Which one do I... Oh. Not WASD, I just click. Damn it. Yeah, you know, it's not a bad thing to Shit. accept some help. I thought Lee was gonna like fall off the roof with it for a second. That was the bells. Yeah. Could buy us some time. Draw as many as we can this way. Get down off just the roof that on the opposite is sturdy side enough. and bust In the our middle, it's gonna be like super weak. You shouldn't be the one to go. Why not? My leg's feeling better. Let me do it. I'll do it. If we have to decide who takes a risk like this, it should be the guy who's got the least to lose. What's the worst that could happen? Fair. I get bitten again? So we're agreed then. Though I do appreciate the offers, and if it gave me a choice between the two, I was actually gonna let Ben do it, because then it's like, yeah, there you go, go ahead and be Maybe helpful. Maybe we should have someone more able-bodied doing that. You sure you're up for it, Lee? Say that again and you're gonna find out. <laughs> Fair enough. No, he's a man on a mission right now. He's not gonna stop until we get Clementine back. 
Assuming we get Clementine back. Oh, I hope the ladder doesn't shift here. Oh, dang it, it did start shifting! Okay. Well. Ha ha! Ha ha ha! Sorry, killed a zombie. Holy shit, man! <laughs> Are you okay? I can't tell if I made that that yeah. was cool or. I'm fine! I was wishing I had my other hand. No shit! Try to find another way out of there? Can I go down? I'll check before I ring it. Nope. It's locked. Shit. We're, I think we're gonna have the to super jump it back. Alright, well, here's the bell. Make sure there's not a zombie inside. There'll be thousands down below. Okay. Let's pull the rope, ring the bell. Ah, thank you, Molly, for this idea. You know, I bet she hears that bell right now. She's thinking of us. Or another creep who decided to ring the bell. But for the sake of it, let's say us. They're coming okay. this way. Now for the fire escape. Tons of them. Jesus. Where? Now get back here. Okay, give me a sec. Force the ladder up. Jedi mind powers are awesome, right? I think I have to jump. There's no way back. Fuck, be careful. Okay. It's not that far. You got, you got this. You got this, my <laughs> Sorry, I love that motivation. That's fun. You're okay, Lee. Please get a running start, Don't look man. down! Okay, I won't. Good, you're getting a running start. Don't make me click to do it. Just jump on your own, please, Lee. And... Super jump and grab ledge! Oh, jeez. Blanding like that would hurt. Ow, like ribs. Nice. But he made it. Yeah, okay. Now let's get the hell out of here. He made it. And yeah, that side is definitely a lot more clear. It looks completely clear, actually. But if not, it's at least a lot more clear. Oh. Forgot we still had a gun. <laughs> cool. Not gonna bother with double tapping. No, Lee is confident. Confidence. You motherfuckers! What? That was Kenny, right? What happened, Kenny? Why is the boat gone? What the fuck? They fucked us! What? Who? Vernon. He didn't have Clem. So where the fuck is she? Mm. With someone else. We're going after her. Fuck. Just... Jesus. Oh, that's Vernon and his crew took our boat. That's patients great. patients did this? Yeah, they were waiting. Tired of living underground, I guess. They kicked the shit out of me and tossed me in here. Mm. Wait, what the hell happened to you? Yeah, he Cut just notices the... Seriously? Yeah. I lived through it, which is a start. And, well... Uh... I thought it might buy me some time. You know, get that bite off my body? Hopefully whatever's gonna happen takes longer. <sighs> Jesus. Yeah. Hopefully. Omid, well, now we have no escape plan. Let us into the backyard. We shouldn't be out in the open. Yeah. This sucks. This is not happening. Everything is so fucked. Clementine is still out there. So we get Clementine, and then what? We get the That's fuck out of know. cities. I'm done with cities. We go into the countryside and make a go of it. Yeah, that seems like a good idea to me. Nobody asked you. You just did. <laughs> Don't get fucking smart with me, Ben. Chill. Do you remember we had a boat? A boat! Get over it! Krista's right. The boat was a pipe dream. We so still the boat was good while we had it, then we just we don't have it now. we and rethink our entire plan. Rethink? How about we just think for once? That's what I'm saying we do. Calm down, Kenny. Yeah, chill. Oh, uh, that was bad. Thank you, Omid. Saved by the opening we of the do door. This in the yard. Ben, I swear to God. What do we do without a boat? 
I think that is the best plan. Get to the countryside. Dicked around with cities. It was the safest we'd been, aside from the crazy, you know, cannibal people. Live as safe as you can. The okay? St. John's. Look, yeah. I agree with you. I think out in the country is the safest place to be. But you're not dead yet, so put a pin in that, okay? Okay. I'll be honest, I was talking so I didn't hear what I said. Where the hell do you said. get off? I'm just saying we should all chill. Not just you. Chill. Lee's bitten in God knows how long he has left. Clementine is who the fuck knows. And we're robbed of the only hope we've had. So? So Lee should have left your ass in Crawford. We got enough problems. Fuck you, Kenny! Oh. Alright. Careful, guys! No, let him. I am so, so... So sorry about Katya and Duck. I am. And I know I fucked up. But stop pushing me around and stop wishing I was dead. No! You know how they died. You've said goodbye. I never got to see my family, my parents, my little sister. Do you get that? Your family is gone, but at least you had them to lose. I never made it home. They could be alive, or dead, or walkers, or worse, and I don't know! So give me a fucking break! Oh, Ben, I'm... Yeah, I didn't even think about that. He was just on a oh, school shit. trip, huh? Here they come! In the house! That's sad. <laughs> but it seems be able have gone through the backyard, decay. right? So that's good. Maybe not. We can secure this place. Krista. Get upstairs. Make sure nobody's here. On it. We'll remember that. Kenny. That's good. Look for weapons. Gather anything you can find. Maybe we'll I should have had him help me barricade. Ben, you're helping ben. me barricade. Move anything you can up against the doors and windows. Got it. Only I'll kill anything that gets inside. What is it? Oh, oh, oh. Front doors! Oh! Kick him! You're not a dog! How many times do I have to kick him? There we go. Glad it didn't start moving. Lee! Help! Cut their fucking arms off! Do we have an axe? Knife or something in there. Okay. Knife, 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 knife. Yes! First try! Take their goddamn arms off! Alright! Shove it on Mason, get your heads! Come on, Krista, why couldn't you have been like this? Good. Alright. Now what? Get ready to fight. This place seems dirty to me. I think we're fine. You're wrong, Krista. Just a bit. Dirty my ass! <laughs> Get upstairs! Go! Hopefully there's a way out of stairs. Was there a window in the attic? Guys, help me with this! Okay, push the desk. Alright. Unless we can completely barricade the stairs, yeah. That would be good. If we could just barricade the stairs, that would be a lot better. Come on, 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 come on. Yes. Everyone get to the end of the hallway. Go, go, go. Oh no, we're just setting up some shoot over, aren't we? Get to the end of the hallway! Take a fucking stand! Jeez, okay. This is cool! Let's get as many as we can. When we see an opening, we go for All right. it. How many bullets y'all have? Three. Five. Four. Two. You all know where to aim. Jeez. Get ready. Should we really use all our ammo here? Uh, did we just ditch our butcher knife? No, we didn't! We didn't! I have the most ammo. I have the most ammo. Are you guys not actually gonna hit people? I'm not out. I only saw like four times, I think. I'm out! Me too! Fuck! Where do we go? There's no goddamn opening! Up! Yep, that's right. I kinda go. thought we were just gonna hide, like run and shoot thing. You know, from, like, Left 4 Dead. <laughs> there goes our gun. Not like we had bullets left anyway, I guess, right? Yep. 
Okay, now look for a window. Um, I'm not good with these. You dropped it down there. You, wait, is that my gun or is that the one he was? Was he using one? Did he pick it up before he went up? Good that job, Ben. Better. Everyone okay? Lee's still bitten. Shut up. Okay, let's get out of here and keep moving. Kid's right. We gotta keep moving. Think there's any chance we get I Clem mean, and catch already. up to those goddamn thieves? I don't know. Maybe. Well, we're not going out through this window. No. No latches, no roof access, and 30 feet straight oh, down. Dang it. Anyone have any ideas? I bet this guy what if, would. What if we tie all this our coats together? He's got air about him. Knock it off. Dixon Kent the no. third. Industrial... <laughs> Need... Krista. Just trying to lighten the fucking tone. We need solutions, not stupid jokes. They'd both be appreciated for me, at I'm least. I'm sorry. Let's get out of the way. So, no ideas, then. There's got to be another way. Check the floor for any other access, okay. a vent, anything. Or we wait for the house to clear out and stick to the high ground. <coughs> Is it hot, Lee? Hey, you're not looking great. And you're warm. I'm okay. Don't. She's at the Marsh House. What did that mean? She's at the Marsh House. She's at the hotel. Oh, good. Where her parents were staying. At least we know where she is now. He hasn't We know she's out. alive. We know yes. she's yeah. scared, but yeah. we know where she is for now. We need to start thinking about more than just Clementine when it comes to our urgency. What do you mean? How do we get out of here? That's the whole point. We don't know. Okay, now your life depends on it. How do you get out of here? I don't know. Can we look around first, Kenny? I get it. I do. Like I said, everyone needs to keep looking for a way out, damn it. We're trapped in here. Do you think that worked? I, I don't know. Mm. I hope so. I think we need to have an adult conversation about what happens if Lee takes another spill. Okay. That's hey, fair. Look, we could be looking at a Larry situation here. I'm that strong. Larry? It don't matter. He looks fine to me. Okay, what do you want to do? Just talk about it. No, no. Does that conversation end with me getting something dropped on my head? Now, hey! Guys, I don't know what happened before Omid and I showed up, but we can cross this bridge when we get to it. Lee, I'm not advocating anything here, but how is this not a thing? We're all so worked up about Clementine that we're forgetting what the fuck happened to you. My arm is not the issue. I'm not the problem. The 500 walkers in the house and no door in this room are the goddamn problem. I don't like this part. Yeah, maybe at the moment. Because I want to talk about it. say when it becomes an issue? At that point, there may not be any time left to deal with it. This is getting out of hand. You're going to listen to me. We will get Clementine back, with or without you. Because I haven't given up everything to die because we were stupid. I'm sorry, okay? Fuck, we can't do this. We're going to have to. That's good. You ruined that dude's face. <laughs> Shut up, sweetie. Look. Uh, it's corroded to hell. What's on the other side of this wall? Okay. A thirty foot drop? No. This man butts up against the one next door. Wait, wait a minute. I'll be damned. We're not lifers on Alcatraz here. We can't spend the next three months. Did that work? This wall ain't shit. Is this really possible? Okay. Maybe. Yeah, we can do this. Okay. Honestly, Floor I feel like using shifts. the other end would be Omid, better because Krista it's smaller, I, so you'd have more pressure on that rest. one point where you could break board, fast. board, you know. Anyway. Sorry. Me too. I get it. Go sit down. Okay, yeah. So, I didn't like that scene, but if it was just for the sake of showing that there's a damaged wall, then I can understand. But I was always trying to look for, yeah, let's talk about this. I'm game. I understand that this is a serious problem and we I'm need to address it. So it's just, you know. It would have been easy not to. Yeah. Well. We probably would have let you go alone if you hadn't told us. 
Which would have been a mistake. Yes, it would have. If I were you, I would have been scared shitless. <laughs> it was. Oh, yeah. I, uh, and when it happened? I panicked. But now I feel it inside me. The day before you get the flu. It's horrible. It's so weird. I keep doing a double take on your arm, expecting it to be Me there. too. I'm hoping whatever's in their bite is gone too. What do you think the odds are of that? I don't know. I know everyone's wondering. Even if it just slows down the process, I'd be happy. Yeah. You don't it's know. It's not the best thing, but... So when we get this guy, what do you think? Yes, I did it. We just get Clementine, that's the focus. Despite how I feel, I, I, I can't let vengeance be the thing. Sure, but if it's not that easy... Then we'll kill it. We'll do whatever it takes. And, you know, whatever happens to you... Uh... Seriously, can we not talk like that? The entire time we were at the hospital, I could sense you think you're as good as dead. I was bitten, Krista. You cut it off. What good is it to plan around that work? What good is it for you to give up? I haven't given up. Uh, well, Clementine does like them. If they'd be up for it, you know? I want you guys to take it. Stop it. I'm serious. She'd be safe and relatively happy. Relatively. To. We're not doing this right now. Krista, listen to him. It's what I want, okay? What about him? We uh, gotta support him. He's only a kid still. It's easy to forget that. He loses shit like that often? No. That was a first. Yes, it was. It's good that he did. Kenny couldn't pull that shit on me. Kenny's been horrible to her. He blames Ben for his family's death and... It's just more complicated than that. Well, seems like it got through to Kenny. Yeah. Which for. I'm glad for. All right. If it better's the I'm relationship. You look good and rested. Sure. <laughs> if you don't count an infected leg. But you said it was feeling better. You want me to do it? Nah, and you can hop in after me. So we're we just gonna have cycle through and have more discussions with people. Oh, but look, he made some Shouldn't progress. Be long now. It's good we're forced to take a breath. <sighs> That, uh, feeling any better? Um... I can handle it. Pain, that is. I'm just really goddamn tired. I mean, do you think it worked? Did it, did it help at all? Did Lee say it seemed to have solved the process? I feel like a man who got bit. So, take that for what it's Fair worth. Fair enough. I still can't believe you went and got chomped. Just, fucking hell. At least he told us. Took some brass. I don't think I would've. How are you? I'm... Uh, I don't know how to answer that. I'm sorry. You've lost more than anyone. Well, as much as anyone. It'll be alright, kid. Why are you acting like what's happened ain't happened? Which part? Anyway, I appreciate it from both of you. A lot of us have lost families. Maybe take it easy on him from here on out. I'm angry as hell. Not at him. Maybe. Maybe not. You heard him outside. I did. I never really thought about it. Yeah. That way. No, when a character really opens up about their story, their feelings like that, it can just be bad. Oh, hey! This guy tell you much about what we've been through? Bits and pieces. Before y'all, we had this woman, Lily, with us. Lord knows where she is now. Anyway, we had to make some tough calls with her dad. She came between Lee and I pretty good. And I spent a lot of nights hating this guy's guts. Yes, sir. I'm sorry for hurting you in any way, kid. It's impossible to go through life without causing some sort of pain. But sometimes I can't help but wonder if I could have caused a little less. You and me both, Doc. Well, cheers. Okay, that seemed to have gone well. 
if we can mend a relationship. Yeah, let's just let's numb the pain a little. Just a little cheers, you know? Not turn him down in this moment. You can't. You can't, you might be preggers. Oh. <laughs> How much did she have? Look at Kenny's face. Hmm. I'm through. Oh, sweet. I thought someone else, like at least one more person, would have to take another no go walkers. at it. Things are looking up. Where does that lead to exactly? Is it just another 30-foot drop? 